What is going on guys? My name is Ron back in from Roman Reviews with another episode reaction to Classroom of the Elite Season 2, Episode 2. There are two main human sins from which all of the others derive. Impatience and in, in, indolence? Indolence? Indolence. Indolence. Words. What is going on? I do apologize again. I'm going to be late on these reactions um, going forward. Um, and depend on how things line up in the next month or so possibly on hiatus for quite a while we will see what happens i'm not going to say anything because nothing's been set in stone just an opportunity has arisen and i'm probably going to at least attempt at it but i will let you know if anything changes in the near future um but getting back on it i do want to thank everyone for sticking around for my last episode reaction i can tell it was a very boring reaction probably from my end but a lot of people were saying it's okay there was a lot of heavy stuff in this there was a lot of, it was just a really jam-packed information filled episode um so that was really um really nice of you guys uh i'm really looking forward to this i have no idea what to expect everyone keeps on saying that oh man this show is gonna be. This season gonna be popping. But I heard, apparently I've also heard that they've cut a good amount of stuff. I think I'm going to probably watch a video on that. I haven't seen it yet, but I'm probably gonna go watch a video on it just to see where things have been cut. Um, as long as they're of course not spoilers, and I'll I'll make sure um, of that in, of, if that's the case, um, whether or not they're spoilers or not. But. I do apologize if you hear background noise. I do have my air purifier on. I would have my fan on. In fact, I really want to have my fan on because it is boiling in Las Vegas right now. In Las Vegas right now, excuse me. Um, I think it's around 113 right now. And it is brutally hot. I'm also still in my work clothes. So that's why I'm wearing just a black shirt. Um, so yeah. But I'm ready to jump into this episode, so without further ado, let's jump in to the second season of the second season of Classroom of the Elite, starting in 3, 2, 1, let's jam. There are two main humans, so, oh, it's, it's, uh, it's the episode name. Franz Kafka. Is that a, oh, okay, I was like, oh, I don't always just see an ass in the corner, but it's, it's him. Dude has dude is ripped. But is it true? Kushida? I don't know. I forgot they're Mars, right? No. I think, like, I think I remember reading some, like, Hoenji is actually, like, like, actually, like, ridiculously smart. Still, I don't know, like, song-wise, I don't think it's as good as first season. Now, visual-wise, I think it's actually really, really damn good, close to it. Um, however, I still think the first season's opening um, takes the cake for the better of the two. Hold on. I realize this makes my face really, really bright, so I'm going to turn off the uh, background light.
Yeah, he he kind of goes to the beat of his own drum. I just love how there's a bar just right in the background. They're all high school kids. That's a word you don't see a lot though, gregarious of all the of all things. Yeah, if they want any attempt to win. I don't care, you're still not in high school. Neither is the guy next to you. I, one thing I will say, I'm, it might just be due to the translations, but they like to um, use these bigger words. Ex like, extrapolate? I don't really see that a lot. Knocking on wood. I'm sorry, sir. Uh, can I see your... Okay, never mind. That's sparkling water. I was about to say, let me see your ID. <laughs> Not a fan of sparkling water. We're in the end game now. Like, that is also one thing, like, 
class A would probably have to think like they have the biggest target in on their backs in a way. Now what are you thinking? What are you thinking about this whole situation? Oh, is this K? Yep. I know this is going to be building up a lot about K. So I'm curious. Apparently there's something that was censored with her too. I didn't see it though. She's definitely going to be a big factor in the season. It's going to be K. Okay. Or Kushida. Either or. It's Kushida. Okay. Yeah, K okay, was still in the bathroom, so. You, you know you can drop the act. Oh, well, maybe. Just stabs him. There was a door opening noise. I I, I can never take her. I'll never be able to take her seriously after seeing her in the second episode. Um. <laughs> ah, very surprising. Pinky. Like, I know the teacher, like, knows a, a bit about Ayana Koji. No, oh, the girls from the last episode. I don't know, giving some things I said. It's like throwing a white glove at someone. And not the girlfriend?
Was it just an act? Oh, 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 I like that. I like that little uh, transition right there. Hmm. So, I didn't think, I didn't know that. I wonder why. It's not good coffee. Yep. Cloud? Hmm. Dating. Yeah, he's pretty open about the whole situation. I have a feeling, she, it's almost like she has a feeling of abandonment issues. Because she's always, need, like she said, she keeps on saying she needs someone next to her. She needs to be next to someone. Something, yeah. So I'm guessing it's a sense of abandonment, almost. Like, she had, that's the, the issues she's having. Again, I know we're going to be getting a lot more in-depth uh, with her. Jeez, don't act so down when you see him. No, immediately leaves once she sees him. Oh. She's such a complex and interesting character. Like, I definitely want to know more about her. Okay.
It's been going on for a minute. I wonder if it's almost like she needs a, f a form of validation? In a way? You gotta follow her? Probably. You know, I still, I keep on forgetting they're on a boat. <laughs> I'm sorry. Every time, it's just like, it's so extravagant. Yeah, at least they're... Did they go into the girls' restroom? Restroom? But she did admit to the other guy. I I kind of agree on K, like Okay, was Rika hurt? Was she injured? Did it leave bruising? Did it leave marks? Did it leave scars? But if she just was like, eh. I know, I kind of feel like they're just blowing this a little bit out of proportion. So they're just sadists. Hold on. I feel like this is going to get really interesting in a second. All three of you are cunts. Just saying. All three of you are disappointments to your parents. You fucker. Why are you gonna end it there? Uh, okay, okay, okay. It's gotta be next episode. Next episode, we're gonna be getting something. We're gonna be getting something. They're setting up way too much for that. Alright, um, because this video is going on a little bit longer and I have uh, some stuff to do. Just out of curiosity, because I wanted to see if there was an ending. Yeah. Again, I don't. I don't know. I. I really don't know. There. There is a lot more decay than meets the eye. And I don't want to look it up, because I don't want to spoil myself. But we're gonna be getting a lot more of K, relatively soon. We're gonna see a lot more again. Um. I, my theory, she has abandonment issues, um, she, and then she basically needs validation. She, she needs someone to validate everything about her, which funny thing is, I could see that being very draining on her person, unless they're specifically, like, who knows how to do it and does it well, but I can feel like just being tiring, like, always being there, always, like, being on her side. I, I could see that being very taxing. So, spoiler. I'm trying to figure out how this happens. How Aina Koji 
and Kay get together. Because, yeah. Um, I don't really know. I really don't know how those two connect. And the funny thing is, I think that the fact that I still have no clue on how they connect in that way. Unless it's a fake relationship. But I didn't really see that. Not from the the spoiler when I accidentally read it. Um, it didn't seem like it was a fake relationship like the um, previous boy, boyfriend, quote-unquote. But yeah. Um, but yeah. Let me know what you guys thought in the comment section below. Again, I was pretty quiet. Try to be a little bit more reactive, I guess you could say. Um, a little bit entertaining. I tried. Uh, but again, most of the time I was just really po focusing on everything going because I don't want to miss things. But yeah. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode of Reaction. And unfortunately, I don't really think I'm going to be able to get to more than one series. But we'll see what happens. I am extremely busy with my current job. And if things change in the next couple of weeks or month, it it'll be even busier, but it'll be better in the long run but we'll see what happens but anyways guys i'm probably gonna go rest now because i'm on close to passing out uh but yeah thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you guys next time peace